Today we're going to be ordering and comparing numbers up to a million and we will also be determining the value of each digit within a number. When we're ordering and comparing numbers, we can either order them into a sequence or we can use greater than or less than signs in order to compare the numbers. When we're ordering them in a sequence, we will be asked to order them in either ascending order or descending order. Ascending order is when the numbers increase in value from smallest to largest, and descending order is when the numbers decrease in value from largest to smallest. Here is a place value chart that has a ones column, a tens column, a hundreds column, a thousands column, and a ten thousands column. And you might have noticed the new column, which is the hundred thousands column. This is the column that has the highest value out of any of the other columns to its right. Here are the numbers 357,000 and 255,000. If we put them onto our place value chart, we can see that they both have their highest value digit in the hundred thousands column. So in order to compare these two numbers to see which one is greater or smaller, we need to look at which one has the greatest digit in the hundred thousands column. As you can see, 357,000 has a three in the hundred thousands column and 255,000 has a two in the hundred thousands column. We know that three is greater than two, therefore 357,000 is greater than 255,000. Here we can use the greater than symbol. Let's try another example. Here are the numbers 769,000 and 785,000. Again, if we put these on a place value chart, we can see that they both have their highest value digit in the hundred thousands column. As you can see, both of our numbers have the digit seven in the hundred thousands column. So we can't use the hundred thousands column to compare these two numbers. In order to do this, we look to the column with the next highest value to the right, which is the ten thousands column. In 769,000, there is a six in the 10,000s column, and in 785,000, there is an eight in the 10,000s column. This means that 785,000 is a larger number, so 769,000 is less than 785,000. We can use the less than symbol to show this. But what if we're comparing more than two numbers at once? Let's give it a go. Here are three numbers, 356,824, 453,700 and 344,901. When we order these numbers in descending order, we start with the greatest number. All of these three numbers have their highest value digit in the hundred thousands column. Therefore, we need to look at which digit in the hundred thousands column is the greatest. We know that four is the greatest digit in the hundred thousands column and is therefore the first number in our sequence. We are now left with 356,824 and 344,901. Both of these numbers have the same digit in the hundred thousands column. So you guessed it, we need to look to the place value column to the right, which is the ten thousands column. 356,824 has a five in the ten thousands column and 344,901 has a four in the ten thousands column. So therefore, 356,824 is greater than 344,901, so is the next number in our sequence, followed by 344,901. We can check this using a number line too. Here is a number line that goes from 300,000 to 500,000. Can you try and place our three numbers on the number line? Pause here whilst you have a go. Well, we know that 453,700 is going to go between 400,000 and 500,000 as it has a four in the hundred thousands column. We know that 356,824 belongs just after 350,000 as it has a three in the hundred thousands column and a five in the ten thousands. And we know that 344,901 will go just before 350,000 because although it has a three in the hundred thousands, it only has a four in the ten thousands, which is less than the five in 350,000. Thanks for watching. See you next time.